These original works of art are amazing. From a Bob Ross portrait to this Harley Davidson, you can see how much detail the artist puts into each one. But they're no ordinary paintings. They are tiny, created by miniature artist Karen Leibcap. I know people are like, oh, you're much bigger than I thought you would be. <laughs> um, but yeah, there's not very many people that do miniature painting. So when you say that, they don't quite understand what it is you do until I show them. But most of my stuff's no bigger than an inch and a quarter by an inch and a quarter. Karen can do typical size paintings as well, but she says these minis are much more her style. And I was doing these big paintings and was having a hard time finishing them. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, well, what if I went small? And it was just like a natural thing because when I was little in elementary school, I'd always get in trouble for writing my name too small and, you know, just writing too small. So I've always been, I've always liked uh, writing and little things. She does commissioned work, but left on her own, she paints album covers, movie posters, animals, and just about any random object. Everything that I do, I can relate to in one way or another. Like I grew up with a toy or my brother loves frogs or you know, I just, I do stuff that I can relate to. Her art is so small, she uses her fingernail as her palette. How do you get so much detail into such a tight space? A lot of patience and a tiny brush. When I started doing them, it was almost like therapy, like I would get lost in doing them. Um, and the more I do, the more detail I try to get in them. So they're taking me longer and longer. She spends several days painting some of these minis. When you're working this small, everything is magnified, so there's little room for error. And if you're off by one dot, it could change the look of the whole thing. Karen paints an original and then prints only 20 reproductions, so her art is limited, but the prints make it available to more people. In Hoover, Lisa Crane, WVTM 13 Chronicle.